Hey everyone, Gary here with Nerd Dad. So, <clears throat> I'm back again with another unpopular opinion. Again, this is my opinion, and I feel that it's just not the popular one. And this one, this is truly an unpopular opinion. I'm not a big fan that Boba Fett came back to life. There, I said it. I know that in the past there was a storyline somewhere that said Boba Fett crawled out of the Sarlacc pit, made his way back, and he survived. That's, that's just a side story. That, that's, not, that's not Star Wars canon, I guess you could say. Boba Fett died in Jedi. Return of the Jedi, Boba Fett died, he fell in the Sarlacc pit, and he was digested, as 3PO said, for a thousand years. I, I don't understand why it's so difficult. And the main reason I bring this up is because The Mandalorian, Disney show, uh, Disney TV series based on uh, just uh, the figures, the characters, I guess you could say, the Mandalorian culture in the Star Wars universe, it was great. The first season was brilliant. I loved it. We got to see him build his armor, build his classes, go through his ranks, figure out you know where this child came from. How, where's he going to take him? What's he going to do with it? Everything. It was brilliant. Then the second season rolled around and we started seeing this Boba Fett armor. And then the next thing you know, we see Boba Fett. And I'm like, you gotta be kidding me. Come on. Why are you messing up the Mandalorian? Now I'm really not that excited to see the last season or, or the next season or whatever. It just... It upsets me because they had such a great storyline going with The Mandalorian. They could have just kept it going, run out the program, however you want to do it. Put Boba Fett somewhere else. Now we've got this teaser that Boba Fett's going to take over the Hut gang? What is that? No. No. I'm sorry. If they wanted to bring Boba Fett back and do a series on Boba Fett, then why didn't they do one... Shortly after his dad died, say five, six years after his dad died, show him building his eventually becoming the, the most feared bounty hunter in all of the galaxy. Show him becoming that. No, no, no. Now we've got to see him sitting on Hut's throne, running the Hut gang. I'm sorry. I'm just not a fan. Don't get me wrong, I'm, I love Boba Fett as a character. He's an incredible character. I, I truly enjoyed seeing him in Empire Strikes Back and Star Wars. Uh, in fact, my sons and I, this is a picture of my son and I, we met him, the original Boba Fett, the gentleman that wore the Boba Fett outfit in Empire and Jedi named Jeremy Bullock. He, he was a, a genuinely nice guy, very friendly, uh, was very talkative when we met him. He even told us that he had played several other characters because the cast, they just didn't have a lot of people. So he would throw on an Empire an officer's outfit for the Empire. He would throw on a Stormtrooper outfit if they needed one. But he was a genuinely nice guy, and sadly, he, he passed away the end of last year. Um, to me, he will always be Boba Fett. And I guess that's one of the reasons I'm really not a fan of this. So, that's my unpopular opinion. If you, uh, if you like my show, if you like my channel, please subscribe. Hit the like button and uh, hit that bell icon to get future notifications of my videos. And Thank you for watching.